This is an Ahan recording presentation. They no tell it. I'm critical. 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 Fix your face, put you in your place. In it the win it without a trace of your Hey, hey, what's up, my peeps out there? My Aham fans. I wanna welcome you to the pig pen. Uh you got Tanya T in the hot seat again. Uh one more time doing that damn thing. Uh, you know, we represent, we always interview a uh, Houston artist, uh also Aham artists. Uh, and also affiliates. So we like to give them an opportunity to talk about their music, their life, their history, whatever they want to share with us. Now today, we have in the other high seat, Critical. And uh, he is also CEO of Click Type Productions. And we're excited to have you here today on the show. I appreciate it. Thank you all for having me. Well, cool, cool, cool. Uh, you part of Aham, and also you click tight, you know. So you know you're like family, and uh, we're happy to have you here. Also, our first interviewer, you know. So that is really exciting to me. Uh, well, the first question, you know, I have for you is uh, the name Critical. You know, what is that all about? Tell me something about Critical. Uh, critical. They came from. Hard, which is my uncle, because uh, at first I had, my rap name was Maniac D. All right, all right. You know, but he was like, man, we gotta find a better name for you. Gotta find a better name for. You. I said, you know, so I told him, I said, all right, you know, well, find me a name. So a couple of days went by, whatever. He said, I got the name. I said, what is? It? He said, critical. You know, and that's what it's been ever since then. Well, you know, when something's critical, it's critical. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, that's a tight name, you know. I dig it, I dig it. Well, you know what? Uh, you know, I've been a fan of yours since 98, long time. Uh, yeah. You've been affiliated with AM Recordings, you know. Yeah, right. uh, I think all of your music is hot, your hits are hot. Yeah, uh, yeah. And also your rap style, you know, it, it's really different and it's new. Okay. Uh, now, what I'd like for you to do is, you know, uh, give me some history about yourself. Well, I started rapping maybe in like, i say, the early 89, 90, you know, listening to, you know, NWA and Ice Cube. And That's good music. Yeah, yeah, you know, so during that time, you know, I can really relate to what they was talking about because I was living in Greensport and some things that was going on in Greensport was going on, you know, well, NWA uh, uh, or uh, Public Enemy, you know, rappers like that. You right. Know? So right. that's what I was really on, um, you know. Mm -hmm. I was on a, a movement type, you know, deal, you know, during that time. All right. You know, but ever since then, you know, I, you know, grew, you know, a whole lot, you know, between that time, that, you know, to now. You know. Well, cool. I'm glad you said that to now, uh, you know, since you gave us a little bit about your history. Uh, all the fans out there, you know, we want to know about the present, too. We want to know. Uh, you know, what you got going on? What is critical right now? Well, right now, you know, I am, you know, CEO of Click Type Productions. You know, my co-CEO, Jermaine Jones. Uh, right now, you know, my album, Take One for the Team, you know, is finished, you know, complete. Uh, then as far as that, you know, I also, you know, just completing the ATO, you know, mixtape um, with me, Hard and Craze, you know, and I also have a click type compilation, 
you know, that I'm currently working on right now, you know. All right. How did uh, HTO come about? Um, HTO came about, you know, in the early 90s, you know, just a whole bunch of, you know, homeboys, you know, that were in Greens Point, hanging in front of Sam's Little Store, you know, making right, money, right. you know, throughout the hood, you know, so Craze came up with the ideas, you know, as far as the HTO, you know, you know, and ever since then, you know, it, I was the last member of the HTO, you know, which I'm the youngest of everybody. You right, know, so right. Yes, you, you are. <laughs> you, yeah, you know, so it, it just stuck, uh, you know what I'm saying. Cool, cool. Well, that's cool. Well, that's some good information to know. Uh, your fans out there, they're really interested to know about what Critical is all about. Now, I've done some research, all right, and I've found out that you have two videos. Uh, can you tell me about the first one? Yeah, the first one uh, is out the first album, HTO, uh, which B Dash 3 produced the album, and shot the video. Uh, in a video, everybody see uh, Mia Chico in the video, uh, Big Love in the video. You know, it was just something, you know, we did out the backboard straight out the hood, you know, so, right. you know, to, you know, get recognition, you know, get let people get familiar with seeing my face and, you know, and hearing my music, you know, off the first album. What's the name of that song? So they know. All right. All right. Yeah, this one. Which was a remix was done to a, you know, a thousand mile. Without our knowledge, you know, so. Mm -hmm. Well, I've done my research, too, and I did find that out as well. Uh-huh. Well, uh, tell me about your second video. Actually, I've seen it. Uh, take one for the team. It's the hottest video out there right now. Uh, tell us a little bit something about that video. Uh, well, take one for the team. You know that's just strictly you know just what it is. You know because a lot of people say you know they down with you or they can call them anytime or, or whenever you need me, I'm there. Or, you know, but as far as, you know, people just keeping it real, you know, right. it's, it's not that, you know what I'm saying, you know, because a lot of people, you know, talking and saying names, you know, and this and that, you know, so. Right, okay. Well, guess what? Uh, we want to show you a few clips of the video, uh, take one for the team. Uh, the music was mixed and mastered by B-3, and also the video was done by B-3 Productions. They have recordings, so check it out. You can choose but then life Or the white shit's real scandalous. Don't believe the hype. You just might in your life. Fuck life, flight line. Your people dressing ticks whites wrong or right. It's cold out here. Get stiff like stones out here. We the ones you fear. Hey, your folks shed tears. Bust a move, nigga. This the wild, wild west. Even tip none can't hold your breath in your chest. Uh, don't fight the feeling, niggas want a million Get your money's worth, strike a pose for that million Lights, camera, action, the main attraction Click tight, dope stores, yeah, we close caption I'm talking about red and green, the money team She would pass it up, blow them out like the dream team Bitch, you don't want no cream Bitch, this critical cold, take one for the team Don't choose but that life Don't choose but that life
going for the team. Yeah, and that's, you what's, know, that's what's fun. Yeah, you know, <clears throat> had my whole team in, you know, uh, Calvin, you know, my brother Greg, you know, be there Street, Jazz and Red Productions, you know, Jim right. Brown, Big B, you so know, cool. Haji. Uh-huh. You know, we all just came together, you know, and made it happen. Right, right, right. That's cool, that's cool. So, uh, what was it like? You know, it seemed like it was a little different from uh, they know. Yeah, it was a whole lot. Of, it was a whole lot different. You know, because you know, as far as you know, the the graphics or you know whatever, you know, it was on a whole different level. You know, than from the first time, you know, that we you know did a video. You know, so it was something new. You know. Right, right. Well, I saw that, and uh, it was really great. It's a great video. Um, You're welcome. You're welcome. Uh, Well, we just have a couple of more questions, and, you know, I really feel like these are important questions, you know. Now, um, as far as your rap style, you know, uh, what do you think you can do to, like, change up the whole rap industry? You know, especially where, where Houston is concerned. You know, do you think maybe you can uh, take something different or put something different on the table? Yeah. You know, as far as my whole style is concerned, you know, and the the things that I talk about, you know, Houston has a lot of talent, you know, but, you know, we can't get complacent about, you know, about the... Pop swing and bang, you know, and sip and serve, you know. We have to, you know, invent in and other thoughts, you know, and and other songs, you know, to make a difference, have a different sound than everybody. You know, we don't want to have the same sound, you know, which we don't sound like nobody, you know, but we don't want to have the same sound that we've been, that we at the beginning when we first started out, you know, to where we are now, you know, we don't want to have that same sound. We want to be then elevated, you know, tremendously, you know, from where we was. Right, right. Well, I think you do have something different to bring to the table. You know, as soon as you get to where you want to be, uh, more people get to hear you and actually hear what you have to say, you know. I'm sure they'll become a fan just like I am, you know. Mm -hmm. Uh, You really have some hot hits, you know. Well, uh, a couple more questions. Looking in the future, we talked about your past, your present. Now, we want to talk about your future. Where do you see Critical in five years? In five years, I see Critical as one of the hottest things that in the F came out of Houston. All right, that's what's up. You know, and not just Texas, you know, we're going on a, a, a nationwide, worldwide, you know, hunt, you know, because we're hungry just like everybody else hungry, you know. You know, and I've been down with Aham, you know, since 98. You know, I had a 12-year run, you know, with 98. 198 all the way to what? Uh, 2005, six, you know. You know, and we still doing our thing, you know. So, you know, it's a, it, it's, it's gonna be a never end of story, you know, till we get, you know, what's ours, you know. We want the shrine, you know. We want it all, you know. I started with B3, you know. KP, uh, that was in, you know, 98, 99, you know, when we, you know, did our thing, uh, you know, I opened up for it, just, just about every artist that have, has a name for themselves, that, at that time, that didn't have a name for themselves, you know, um, Critical and Aham open up for, you know, uh, DJ 
with the helps of DJ Marco Polo and Mean Green, you know, Wicked Cricket. Right. You, you, you know, it, it's it's a lot of people, you know, that was involved with Critical. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I just got to give, you know, thanks to, you know, the whole Aham staff, you know, Heinz, you know, Mossberg, Fee, KP, Joey Dexter, B Dash Three, you know, the list goes on and on. Big Love, Candy Stowe, Big J, you know, and even starts before then, you know, with the Acres Home Players. Uh, you know, I remember, you know. When I first heard of the Acres Home Players, that was in '98. Yes, it was. Uh, you know, they used to come to the hood, you know, and you know, get the green, you know, and all that. We chop it up on the music blast, all that. Right, you right. know, you know, we just clicked up on the music thing, you know, when you know. B3, you know, I was wondering, you know, they came through, I was wondering, you know, who KP was because I was like, man, who's this white boy, man, you know, so, <laughs> yeah, you know, because <laughs> the you know, Green's point during that time, you know, it's real hot. Right, you know? right. So I was like, man, who's white boy? I think we all remember that. Yeah. <laughs> you oh, know, yeah. You know, but. You know, come to pass, you know, it was meant for all of us to, you know, click up together, right, you know, right. and work together, you know, because we have done some, you know, major big things, you know, um, you know, and, you know, is this just, you know, just the beginning, you know, of what? was coming, you know, from critical, you know, because it's still uh, one album, you know, from Ahem that hasn't been heard. Right. You know, so, <laughs> you know, so, yeah, I'm, you know, be looking for that also. Right, right. You know, so, you know, it, it, it's the, even though I have, you know, <clears throat> And bitch, I only got and started doing my own thing, you know, because that's what you're supposed to do when this type of business is prosper. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm still, you know, down with Aham, ride with Aham. I'm true. still HTO. You know, I'm the Greens Point representative, or whatever. You know, you know, whatever you want, whatever you want to say, you know, whatever you want to call me. You know, I'm D-Boy, you know, whatever, you know. Hey, I'm going to give the people, you know, what they want. You know, I'm going to try to give them more than what they want. Uh, I just thank for all, you know, just thank for everybody, you know, supporting, you know, D-Boy Critical, you know, Green's Point, you know, Acres Home 4 4 you know, because we clicked up a long time ago. Right, right. right. You know. Even with DJ Marco Polo, you know, so it it it, it goes way back, right? You, right. you know, it it goes way back, and it's a lot of history, you know, behind Critical Ahem, you know, and Green's Point, you know, uh, OG Buck, you know, was behind, you know, the whole project. Uh, uh, Strict Grind, Dexter, uh, Big B, uh, Problem, you know, Disaster, you know, John Germain, you know, everybody that's down with Critical, you know, B-3, you know, everybody that represent Critical, you know, and everything that I'm doing, you know. You know, I, I salute to you, you know, because, you know, that's what we need, positive support. You know, I don't deal with the negativity. You know, I'm trying to 
make a living in a better way, you know, for my family to eat and to live. Right, you right. You know, I don't need no negativity, you know, so if you're about the negativity, you know, you ain't about critical. Right, uh, right. That's real time. That's real time. I feel that. That's cool. Well, you know, uh, what you've given us is a great insight uh, into critical, you know. Uh, if it's been a mystery, well, it isn't anymore. <laughs> we found out today, and uh, we appreciate you sharing this with us, you know. So now when we hear your music and uh, we hear the things you have to say, we know that it's coming from your heart and it's coming from uh, your life experience. You know, so we really appreciate you coming uh, to the show today. Yeah, I appreciate y'all for having me. Well, cool. Uh, do you have an album coming out soon, a new album? You want to tell yeah. us about it? Yeah, um, Take One for the Team. Um, it features um, HB Street Grind, that's Dexter. Um, it features many stars, which is on the single "Take One for the Team." Uh, so that is the album title. Yes, "Take One okay, for the Team." Okay, great, yes. great, great. Yes. Uh, I also have "Hard" on the album. I have "Craze" on the album. I also have "Hygie" on the album. You know, and I also have "Drakey" on the album. You know. Um, that's who's distributing, you know, my album, um, Drake Key, you know, the um, CEO of Breakthrough, um, through Interscope, you know, so. All right, all right. You know, so we, you know, trying to make it happen. Okay. You know. uh, critical, take one for the team, album title. Uh, do we have a release date? Or are we still working on that? No, we don't have a release date yet. All right. We're still waiting on paperwork to get cleared. Right, I understand. Those type of mess, you know. Yeah, those are some yeah. things you have to go through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do it, understand. It takes a minute on that. Well, we just can't wait, okay? Yeah. And as soon as uh, uh, you can get that out, we'll definitely have it out on the website and we'll have a date. And I'm pretty sure, you know, we'll make sure everybody knows. Uh, well, you know, we do appreciate you coming today. Uh, this is uh, close to the end of the show. I'd like to thank everybody uh, for uh, tuning in to the Pig Pen uh, with your girl, Tanya P, in the hot seat. Always represented for Ahab Recording. And uh, before we yep. get out, I have uh, one more thing. If there's anything you would like to tell your fans out there, what would you tell them? I would say, uh, you know, uh, critical is something new, something different, uh, different topics, you know, some positive, you know, not all just positive, you know, some things might be considered by other people as negative, uh, but it's good music. Uh, club bangers, you know, some for the women, you know, some for the niggas, you know, anybody, you know, that ain't hating, you know, this album is for y'all. You know, I got Random Face featuring on the album, uh, Many Stars, HB Strict Grind, Hard Craze. You know, uh, Buddy Row. Uh, you know, it's a couple more people, you know, that I'm working with, you know. Just, you know, just support Critical Man, keep it real, you know, because I'm going to keep it real with y'all, you know. I ain't no hell, I ain't no be saying nothing or uh, in, something in a video that ain't really there, you know what I'm saying? Saying it's mine, you know, so it, it's going to be real at all times with me. You know, uh, just keep it one hundred, man. You know, let let's shit. Let's let's make this money. Let's put Houston back where we supposed to be. Let's put Texas back where we supposed to be. Cause right now, you know, it's a whole lot of bullshit in the game. You know, that ain't supposed to be there. You know, hey, let's bypass that, man. You know, and and, and make this thing happen. You know, 
and love haters, man. There's niggas that love your shit and hate your shit, but really they love your shit. You know, so I'ma just do critical, man. Uh -huh. The Greens Point represent. <laughs> That's what's sad. That's what's sad. All right. Well, thanks a lot for tuning in to the Pig Pen and our guest today, Critical. Thanks a lot for coming. We oh, enjoyed man. you Thank very you much. Okay. Me, what a wonderful interview. Yeah, really enjoyed yeah, it. Yeah. And uh, we want to give you some information uh, to get in touch with Critical or to listen to his music. You can uh, check it out on the website. That'll be Greenspoint Representer. Dot G -E at gmail.com if you want to send them an email. Say, hey, we saw the interview, really liked it, check it out. Also, uh, Critical, take one for the team. You can find that on YouTube. You type in 56 Critical, that's 56 Critical, and you'll get take one for the team. Also, you can check them out on Facebook. As I said, it's AM Recordings, changing the industry. Peace out. This time I took it on y'all easy. The next interview, I'm gonna really give it to y'all, man. Tell you, tell you, let me, let me, you know, let me have mercy on y'all this time, you know. So next time, you know <laughs> what I'm saying? You know, I'm just saying, you know, just what it is. You know, I just want everybody to know, support critical. You know, support the Greens Point Acres Home movement. I'm trying to go and y'all already know what it is. You know, we're getting it. A ham and click tight. You know, ain't nobody better. Ain't nobody better. Yeah, put your H's in the air. What's up? That's what's up. Peace out. The Wayne, the Wayne, the Wayne. A.K.A. H.T. Owen, the harder than others, H.T. Owen, the harder than others, hard, crazy, smile boy, and ain't, and ain't, and ain't, and ain't, my brother's face with all the numbers. This is a Aham Recordings presentation.